Do you also want to be in the video? How's it everyone? Welcome back to another video. Um, this is a, a bit of a jam-packed uh, episode. Um, I'm not gonna speak too much now in the beginning. There's quite a few things. Uh, I finally got my car back. I'm really happy for that. Unfortunately, I have to drive in a thousand kilometers first. Um, so you can imagine the suspense that uh, is waiting uh, on my end. Um, we also visiting. Uh, we also popped in for a visit by Shaw, uh, the private detailer. Um, but let's just go to some cinematics on the car. Uh, it's not really cinematics, as you can hear. The car sounds um, very nice. Can you stop it, please? Um, uh, this one is now wanting to be in on the interview, so. Um, I just want to show you guys a bit of how the car sounds like from the outside. I'm not going to do the POV pulls yet until the motor has been driven in properly. Um, I'm going to do a bit of a walk around on the car. <laughs> yeah. So what I did was I took some um, a small clip at, at um, garage 10 and then I took a few clips while I washed the car. And then just a walk around on the car. This dog almost ran the wire off. Get away. Move. So I am. My car needs a bit of detailing. Um, I'm, you'll guys see this like a walk around around the car. The car is in decent condition still, but there's a few things that I'm not happy about on the car, like a few scratches and bumps. So I'm going to send my car to show the private detailers. He's sorting me out. Um, probably in next month or something. But yeah, I'll we'll obviously do uh, the content on that while he works on my car um, in future. So 
So I just want to take you guys around the car here just to show you a few scratches and stuff that I want to take care of. And here's one here. There's a few of them actually. Um, and the so what I basically want to do is I want to take the car to show the private detailers, the guy you've seen in the the footage or going to see in the footage. Um, I just need to polish the car up a bit um, and detail it. Take some scratches out here and there. Um, as you can see, the car is nice and clean. There's a bit of water dripping down there still, and that I forgot to wipe off. But um, here is a knock that I got from my neighbor, and um, it's quite deep, so that probably has to be sprayed. Um, but as you can see, the car is nice and clean, the interior and everything. So yeah, I'll give you guys an update on the B20 video at the later stage. I hope you guys enjoyed the cinematics. Um, next up is um, Shaw's business, uh, the private detailers. I will attach his price list. Um, we uh, went to visit him while he was busy with a, a very old car. I think it's a Chrysler if I'm not mistaken. And we all know how hard it is to maintain a black car. Um, it's, it's scratches is very visible on the car. I've, um, I'll add a few photos in also, just to show you guys the before and after. And after that, we've we've taken some cinematics. Also, there is a tribute we did to um, the late uh, Resistance crew member Tariq Tabs Weinenberg. Uh, if you guys have not seen that special episode, um, I'll leave a link here on, <coughs> on the information bar. Sorry for the dogs barking. And but uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the cinematics. So this leaves us to the highlight of the um, episode, uh, what some of us, most of us have been waiting for. But before I go ahead with that, I just would like to let you guys know that once we, once we get our feet on the ground in, and everything, we will be able to bring you guys with more content weekly. Unfortunately, at the moment, it's a bit tough and I can only do it every second week until I found my rhythm. Um, I found some better ways to work around the video editing and um, this dog now wants to come say hello again anyways um, I found a better way to work around the editing um, to to implement a uh, to implement a bit more efficiency so yeah hopefully in future then in the next hopefully from next month onwards I don't want to make any promises but from next month onwards we would hopefully try and get uh, content in every 
every week or so. Um, so we popped in by QBeam's workshop while they were busy working on Remy's car. Um, I added a few clips in. So we hooked up at around 7 a.m. on a Saturday morning after the car was done bagged and we took some cinematics. I'm really excited for this video because this is the first video we've done with the gimbal um, and you will see there's a massive difference in the video stabilization and everything. So I'm really excited to share this video and that is why I kept it for last. I think um this potentially is my best video to date um it really just shows that um with practice you can become better and with the right tools things just become much it, it opens up a world of options for you so i'm still new to the gimbal but obviously uh, it will get better over time but i've tried a few new things on the video so this is a crew feature wednesday car i will leave the link in the description below to the website um, i would just like to mention up front that this is not the final build there is still a few things that remy wants done he wants to widen the wheels he wants to get the back lower but you will see the back isn't that low i think that is a problem or a a stumbling block if i can tell it that with the e46s so he's going to work on that uh widen the wheel still uh there is some spray work in the works if i think i'm not sure i can't remember we did speak about it but there's a pretty few there's a few things that he still need to do on the car um but anyways i hope you guys enjoy the video um Remember, refuse to comply, build your vision. Till next time, cheers.